just finished my coffee and we'll be having breakfast soon. I slept so well. I haven't been sleeping well in the hostels and last night I, I think I was in my hammock about six. I don't know, it was really early. And I slept what felt like all night long and I woke up and it was 11. And then I slept even longer. And um, I just felt so refreshing and so good to be able to sleep like that. Um, I did wake up to rain and was kind of, I don't know, not excited about hiking in the rain. But I went down to the shelter and the talk is that it's supposed to stop at 9. And if the rain stops at 9 and it's just misty and kind of hazy all day, I'll take it. I was really thinking of even going into town and getting out of this and so that just lightens my mood so much. I know that there's rain on the AT and that there's going to be stretches of time where it rains for five days, 10 days straight. I'm not sure how I handle that, um, but for today, I don't have to make that decision. Oh, well, here we go. <clears throat> Let's just hope my friend was right about the forecast and that it's just gonna be a little bit hazy and damp all day. Well, the weather has been holding out, sort of. The sun has been trying to beak out, sort of. And I think I'm hiking up to Beauty Spot. Been going up for a while. wind is really picking up. Can you see the clouds down there? Maybe I'm getting close to the top. Yes, it's definitely opening up and it's starting to sprinkle. <laughs> my brother and our friend Lucky getting dropped off at that parking lot, I think, Miss Janet. And then we went south. So we didn't have to climb, which was great. But I think I'm up to the top. A little socked in today. Not too bad though, a beauty spot. Rain is coming and going, clouds are beautiful, and the temperature is good. I really wish I could capture what it really looks like <laughs> going in through here with the moss and the dark of the trees. It's just, oh.
quick update on the food thing. Um, I don't feel like eating. Nothing's exciting. Um, it's not that I don't like the stuff that I brought. It's just I'm tired of eating. And the hiker hunger has kind of subsided a little bit. So I'm not really like wanting to eat, but I'm still trying to. I've been climbing up these rock stairs for a really long time, or at least it seems that way. Starting to work up a sweat again. The wind has died down, but it's a long way up. I feel like I'm in a scene from a horror movie. It's so foggy. But cool. The truth is I've actually felt a little bit physically sick the last couple of days. Muscles are fine, all that kind of stuff. Leg issues are gone. But my stomach has been upset. Um, little indigestion. And I've been having some fatigue. And, uh... I've also been like a little bit feverish. I almost feel like my fever broke last night um, because I had to strip down to basically nothing in my hammock. It got really warm. I don't know, maybe not. Maybe it's just the overall mood and spirit of things, especially as you can see, mother nature feels the same way. But if there are any hikers out there, through hikers that know, um, you know, six weeks in, what's this? stomach upset stuff let me know it's really so cool through here i just wish i wasn't so tired Whew. i think i'm less than a half a mile from the top that would be great It's a whole other world here. It's really muddy up here. And lots of roots, I better be careful. Need some color. Wow. So cool against the background of green and the fog and the haze. sun is trying to peek out now. It's hard to believe there's going to be thunderstorms all day tomorrow. There it is. Come on, sun. I'm coming to the hostel. No, not hostel, shelter. It's been a long day. I'm glad to be done. I connected with a friend and that was really helpful. Um, I think I need to do more of that. I also have a friend coming on Friday to meet and hike with me for a few days. I think that will lift my spirits. In the meantime, I'm going to set up and uh, buckle down for the storm that's coming tonight. This is my view right now from my hammock. Not bad. And I'm warm and I'm dry. So spirits are good. I am headed back to the shelter to socialize and have some dinner. It's 
So there are no women out here. Yep, just me and like nine or 10 other men at camp. That's what I've been traveling with is a group of men. Come on, girls, get out here. It's not so bad.